four major airlines has resulted in the loss of thousands of nonstop flights to and from dozens of U.S. cities. This has made air travel more stressful and less convenient for millions of us. It severely impacted businesses in every one of these cities. And while working for President Obama, I fought the loss of nonstop service from cities like Buffalo. The business community has to be able to get directly to customers, not via Philadelphia, not via Charlotte or Atlanta. OneJet is America's only successful market-based response to this dramatic loss of nonstop service between critical city pairs, like Buffalo, Albany. This is a special place for me. I'm a fourth generation upstater. When my family came to America, they came to Buffalo and built a life in Buffalo. Go Bills, by the way. In later, Rochester, Jamestown, and Oswego. Hard work, faith, and family built this town, as well as connectivity to the larger New York State and U.S. economy. OneJet is restoring that direct connection between upstate cities and between upstate cities and the northeastern United States. OneJet is really an economic development strategy for upstate and cities across America. If you think back to 1825, Governor DeWitt Clinton traveled a packet boat Seneca Chief from Buffalo to Albany. He carried with him two casks of Lake Erie water that he poured into the Hudson River, thus wetting the waters of the Great Lakes to the Atlantic Ocean, opening the Erie Canal, and literally making New York the Empire State. OneJet's nonstop Buffalo Albany service will reconnect the Empire State in the same way that the Erie Canal did in its day, and it'll strengthen local economies along the way. So get ready for OneJet's latter day Seneca chief to restore nonstop service from Buffalo to Albany. By the way, this Empire Jet will be a lot more comfortable than a packet boat, uh, and there'll be more nonstop announcements to follow. So thank you for coming.